there friends thanks for checking in today we're looking at the new Taurus G3 Toro Taurus introduced the Toro models a couple weeks ago they make this with the G3 and the G3C and they made them optic ready a lot of people want red dots on their pistols it's in high demand and Taurus met the demand with the Toro models now Toro stands for Taurus optic ready option and as you can see you have the option to mount a red dot they introduced themselves into the red dot game with the TX22 competition where they found a way to put a red dot on the hood of the barrel which is very unique but the times that I've taken this to the range, I have really enjoyed it. It's shot great, and it's a very nice setup. But now they have the Toro models, Taurus Optic Ready option, and they created an easy way to mount onto four plates included. I want to talk about that, but before we go any further, let's look at the G3 itself. Now, this was introduced in September of 2019. It was met with a lot of excitement. At the time, they only had the G2C. The G3C wasn't available yet. They, they came out with the third generation with the G3, and Taurus calls it a full-size pistol. A four-inch barrel, 17 and 15 round mags, and they improved the trigger. The G3 has a very nice trigger bar safety in there much wider opposed to the blade and they're calling it single action i'm measuring it just under five pounds with a reset right there for the follow-up shots it still has restrike capability still has the nice grip texturing already talked about the mags the thumb safety locks up the trigger and the slide and they made a very nice handgun you know it had three dots uh, three dot sight system on the original g3 this one has serrated black rear sights pinned in front sights both models are drift adjustable but the way they created this setup was so simple they add four plates in the case allen wrench screws everything that you need and on their site they have which plate will accept what red dots so this is a Vortex Viper. I was able to see Vortex on the site. It says Venom, but it also fits the Viper with a nice tight fit, by the way. And that was the plate number one. I installed plate number one, put the red dot on there. It took less than 10 minutes, literally. It was so easy. So many of the popular red dots are available with the Toro models. I think this is a nice touch by Taurus. A lot of people like... Some of the comments that I get back, people are saying, if it's not red dot ready, then I'm not interested in the handgun. And other people have the mindset, I don't need that thing. I don't want that thing. I'm good with my iron sights. I learned. I was raised that way. And that's the way I want to go. And they do. So it's not for everybody, but there is a large population of shooters out there that want red dots on their handguns. And so what do we got there? Those are grams. Let's see, one pound, seven and an eighth ounce. We'll put the 12 round mag there. And we'll put 15 rounds. So it's loaded weight, two pounds and a quarter ounce. We come over here, that's 32 and an eighth or 32 and a quarter. Let's put another round in there for carry. We're looking at 32 and three eighths ounces. So. It, it remains a fairly light gun for what I call a compact size model. Let's take a look at the internals here. We'll check clear, break down, just like a Glock or the G2C and now the G3C and the G3. Polymer frame, and that does have a dual recoil spring. There's your guide rod, and here is your 4-inch barrel. The Toro model made it nice and easy so simple and i'm going to get this to the range and check out that i love i love the vortex red dots i think they, they do a great job the, the venom is excellent on this and here i've got the viper on the g3 toro i think um, the the g2c was so popular it was really flying off the shelves literally it was flying off of the shelves and now we've got the G3 
C and now the G3. This has been around for about a year and a half. The Toro models have been around just a short time, a couple weeks now, but I think they're going to be a big hit. I think I mentioned the MSRP 40877. They did a nice job with it. They took a popular handgun in the G3 and the G3C, created an optic ready option called the Toro, and they didn't raise the price much more than the original, a little bit. You know, it takes more machining, more technology, various ways to figure out all these different optics and their footprints and create uh, mounting plates to, to have them put on. But those who love red dots on handguns now have the availability with the G3 Toro and the G3C Toro. And I'm going to get this to the range and fire this thing and check it out and see if I'm going to keep that red dot on or put that back plate on and just keep iron sights but i like the option and that's why it's called taurus optic ready option if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe